All right, what's up, guys? So I just recorded uh, Poolside Mystery. This is episode six, I believe, of Real Paranormal Stories. It's getting a little bit dark out here. We're gonna have very big storms. Uh, there's been a, God, there's been a uh, another heat wave, and it's been killing me, because soon it's been really nice down in the basement, but that means more spiders, uh, and but as soon as you go up to like the fourth step, you uh, get this sudden heat. It's been in the mid 90s, low hundreds for like the last four days. Um, so I've been sleeping in my bed because it gets too hot. And it's a pull out bed so I can just get the couch, pull, pull the bed into the couch and then just sleep on the couch. I just put my feet up on a chair and then just sleep that way. It's nice when you have a PS4 and a PS2 and you have all the entertainment that you want. So, uh, uh, so if you watch uh, the Horrifying Nights channel, then you know that I have a series called Paranormal Adventures. And I talked about the first house and the second house. This story uh, is uh, in the second house, but it's not a story for me. Uh, it's from a sibling of mine. And... Uh, she doesn't want her name, video, so I will not do that. So, this was uh, 2012. And she must have been 13, 14. And I'm not sponsored by Sprite. I just love these uh, glass bottles, so I clean them out very 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 good and I put other types of two liter pops in them so it's like I'm drinking out of a glass bottle uh, so one night uh, basically uh, she slept in the basement uh, but that meant that sometimes there would be spiders on her bed so as soon as she sees a spider she would sleep on this huge couch that we used to have and uh, so she would sleep on the couch and one night there was something on her bed, so she went to the couch, and she was sleeping, she was trying to sleep, and she opens her eyes at some point in the night, and she sees this huge black mass, no face, no nothing, and the uh, black mass is just sitting there. Not moving, just sitting there at the very corner of the couch. So obviously she's, you know, freaked out. And she is shaking, she can't move. My first thought was sleep paralysis, but it wasn't. It was definitely not sleep paralysis. So she is just sitting there, she closes her eyes for what must have been like two hours. And when she wakes up, it's around four. Dad is awake and it's gone. But uh, very, very, very creepy. You just open your eyes and bam, there's a huge, huge, huge shadow. But yeah, quick story, but creepy in its own. Next week I'll probably talk about one of my stories. Or if someone else has a story that I'll talk about, then I will. I could talk about a story from uh, my father. Uh, it's a, it's probably the saddest story of the season so far, of the whole series in that matter. But uh, yeah, so make sure to like, subscribe, and I'll talk to you guys later.